Hey, I'm Brian Van, and we are here to talk about August 2016. We're going to open up with Facebook. I've said this a couple of times in these videos, but you know, I say it at the end, and then I look at the analytics, and you know, not everybody goes to the end because maybe they get tired of listening to me talk. So, I'm going to open up with it. I'm pretty new to Facebook, and I'm only on it for a little bit, you know, now, and feels good to have a lot of friends, right? I'm doing okay, but I want some more. Shoot me a Facebook friend request to Brian Van. That's how you find me on Facebook, and uh, I'm going to prove it. We're going to be friends, and it's going to be a lot of fun. Sales, deals, promos. There's going to be some stuff you're going to see here. You know, there's a big CD boot sale going on. It's, it's kind of manufacturer supported. Everybody's running it. Well, we're running it, but we're running a lot better because I got some other boots that I bought on closeout at even better prices you can pick up. I got some suit closeouts. I got some gloves. I got a driven promotion. You name it, I got it. But I want to talk first about I got an interesting email today. It was, you know, a little price match thing, and I get involved in some of those. And it was an advertisement from one of our competitors. And it was one of those blanket 10% off discount codes. You know, they email it to everybody. It's like, oh, wow, I go there. It's my first order. I'm going to get 10% off. This is awesome. And, you know, we reviewed it, and I took a look at it. And then I finally, you know, got to the fine print and went to the page where it showed the excluded brands. And I got to tell you, it was like, uh, it was like 40 plus brands that were excluded. Basically, all the stuff that you would want was absolutely excluded from the discount. And I got to tell you, we do not do stuff like that. Why? Because nobody likes it and it's horribly misleading. Everything you see here, it is straightforward. It is to the point. It is all rider centric. We are here to serve you with the best price, the best service, right? There's a problem. We're here to fix it. And I'm always here to back up every single one of our slash my customers, no matter what the issue may be. Now, let's get in to the CD boots. Okay, we'll start off with, yeah, you're going to see this a few places. Great boot here. This is the CD Vortice. Okay, maximum adjustability. We've got a foot bridge, right? Ankle support, all the techno adjusters all over this boot in an air and a standard model. Former price was $495, $500, a lot of money for a pair of boots. These are $395 for one month only. Take advantage, okay? Mag 1, same thing, available in a standard as well as an air version. This is just the updated, or I don't want to say updated because that's not really fair. This is another top-end race model like the Vortice with a different system. It is all more internalized in terms of the actual skeleton and the bracing for the ankle, right? Same protection, different package. Also, $100 off for a month, going to be down to $395 from $495. Now, let's get into the STG exclusive stuff. We have the CD Cobra boot, only in black and white. We've got a closeout in this. We're running this. I think retail is like $259. We're down to $160 and some change in this colorway. Great boot. I would give this certainly a street boot, high protection, high comfort. You could do track days on this as well. Is it a high-end race boot? Negative. It doesn't have all the ankle support, but it is a very good protective track day slash street boot. CDST. I've got I've got two different models of the ST. I've got the black and white ST Air. I've got a black and yellow fluorescent standard ST. Sizes are getting a little wonky because this has been out for a couple of weeks now on our site. These are down from $395 to somewhere in that $250 range. Great saving, great boot. Trying to finish up a closeout here on the Fusion Air. This is a phenomenal street riding boot. Tremendous ventilation as you can see. This is down to $159. Traffic Air 2. This is a hot weather short riding boot, right? Cruiser, sport touring, you know, is it a high performance sport bike boot? No, there are certain sport bikes where this would probably still be fitting. Really nice boot, $200 retail, $139.95, only here at STG. And now, the CD Astro. This is a really cool short boot. Got some perforation ventilation. We are using the Techno adjuster, right? Little Velcro at the top. Sweet little short boot. 
all day long comfortable. Retail around 200, down to 139, only here at STG. All right, some more great closeout deals here at STG. AGV Sport race suits. You know, we've done a lot with this stuff over the last few years. AGV Sport really brings a lot of performance and value to the table, okay? Little money, lots of bang for the buck. This is their Astra one-piece race suit. This was a $1,200 retail suit. We closed out a colorway within it last year. Uh, it was the essentially Italian color, right? Red, white, and green. We did them for $5.79. We're doing these for $5.79. Those sold like hotcakes. Nice suit. People loved it. We've got multiple colors and sizes available. Check the website for details there. Even better than that, you want to save even more money. We have their Podium one-piece leather suit. Tons of perf once again. Okay, this one had a $900 retail. We are down to $449.95 on that suit. You want to partner up with some gloves that make sense. A good combo with these race suits, right? We've got the Speed and Strength Twist of Fate 3.0. Race gloves, Kevlar lined, palm slider, the whole deal. Good looking glove. The price is right. Retail is about $140, got it out of $79. Great match with these suits. A little, not quite as heavy duty as that, but still super sweet glove. Got a palm slider there, knuckle protector, the whole deal. Great street glove, you know, maybe kind of an entry level track glove. This is the lock and load, and it can be yours for $49.95. Of course, these deals we've talked about are absolutely STG exclusive. Okay, a cool promo for the entire month of August. Comes from Driven. Good friends with the owner over at Driven. We correspond back and forth quite a bit and he loves to come up with different promotions for STG customers. So what we're doing this month, buy a Driven stand, okay? Great values here too. This is their front head lift stand, okay? It's gonna come with an assortment of pins, $116.09. Forklift front, $89.09. I want to show you how they come packaged and how they come set up. This really reduces the shipping weight, makes them more economical. There's a little assembly required, but here is the spooled rear stand down here in the box. Also, same price as that front stand, $89.09. The promo for all of the month of August. You buy that, you are going to get your choice of a pair of driven spools. And it doesn't matter if you buy the rear stand or the front or the forklift front or you buy all three, he doesn't care. They're gonna give you a free set of spools to go with your new stand. And it's only here at STG. Now we're gonna move on, right, to my latest obsession. I'm 46 years old. I turned 46 on July 27th of July. And I'm now obsessed with mini bikes. Absolutely, completely obsessed with mini bikes. I have been riding a mini bike back and forth to work now uh, for about two weeks. Uh, sometimes down the sidewalk, sometimes I go down the road. It really depends on the bike and my mood. Here's my 50. I put a big board kit, I put an FMF pipe, all these really expensive pegs and all these cool things on it, right? I'm having a lot of fun on this thing. It's really fast and I let Evan ride it. You know, one of my guys, Evan, the jet ski guy, probably the greatest jet ski freestyle rider in the entire world, okay? So I let him ride my mini, but he crashed it. He looped it out in like the first three seconds he had to buy me some new parts and that's kind of a bummer, but Evan's a good kid and I still love him. And that brings me to this right here. It's a Honda Grom, man. This is not the brand new model that's coming out. It is the previous model, right? The 13 through 15. There was not a 2016 model. We decided we're going to buy one and build it. Okay, and when we're done building it, we're going to sell it off, right? To buy it with all these cool parts on it. And we are going to start the project with this really cool full system from FMF, right? FMF primarily, obviously off road, everybody knows that, but they do have some offerings for uh, bikes such as the Grand. You know, and they make a phenomenal product. That's honestly what I have on my Mini right there is really super sweet FMF pipe. So, that will be video number one. From there, we are going to mod this thing out. Why? Because it's cool to spend a ton of money on a Mini bike and have a really awesome toy 
that you can ride around. Do wheelies, maybe get in a little trouble, make a bunch of noise, put a really loud pipe on it. Mini bikes are fun, everybody loves mini bikes. While we're still on mini bikes, here's my other mini bike, look at this. Got this from my in-laws out of the barn. It's a 1973 Yamaha MX-80. Runs, it's actually in reasonable shape. My winter project, if I actually find the time, is gonna be restoring this and just making it into a super sweet pit bike. Last but not least, the R3 project. We are almost done. We're gonna be done with that in the next month or so. Follow the page, we're gonna offer the bike for sale and it's gonna have a great assortment of parts on it. Pick up that fully modded, of course, low mileage, hardly ridden, 2015 STG Yamaha R3. That's it for the month of August. I'm Brian Van, SportBikeTrackHere.com.